That might have been a malfunction. We'll, we're going to call it 50-50. It's a toss-up. It's on. Australia opens things up with the possession. Filevich with the defense. Okay. It's a good job playing the passing lanes. Beck Cole, cross-court pass. Garrick, uh-uh, deed up. Filevich, Basis, and, but really over. Couldn't make it count from long range. There we go, Kunick. Filevich trying to clear some space. Oh, bump and a bucket. She cleared butt Beck Cole with a little, little chicken wing, a little elbow right there. But look again. We don't want you here, fam. Filevich, good timing on that block. And good timing on the free throw as well. Ukraine with an early one-point advantage. Beck Cole on the move like the lease is up. She found her new destination. Amounts to a score, 2-2. Two -two. Filevich going to the crossover. She got Keeley following her everywhere. Ruliova couldn't get the two to go. I think that's gonna be key here in this game. Can Ukraine stay in it with the two-pointer? I don't think we're going to see any shortage of offense from the Aussies. I think the way that the only way Ukraine really sticks in this game is if they're consistently knocking down twos. Garrick, she chucks the deuces. She misses that one. Kunick, though, good D. A good hustle, I should say. She, she was able to hit that off of blue. Ball over to Australia. Oh, Koenig, she's turned away at the door. Ohovic, the bouncer, that told her no. 2-2 Two -two it stays. There's Koenig, she's like, crikey! <laughs> All right, here we go, Filevich. Oh, swing through on Garrick. Took her for a ride. Keeley couldn't, couldn't get a handle on it. Oh, oh, Garrett got her cookies took. But Ukraine couldn't capitalize from long range. Now Garrett runs into some trouble yet again. So this Ukrainian defense giving the Aussies a little bit of trouble here to start. The offense slow coming though for both squads. Two minutes in. Oh, and Beck Cole ripped as well. Filevich! Almost an and one. Instead, she's going to shoot one. So, a little bit of a sluggish start here from, from the Aussies. I was expecting them to come out of the gates a little bit stronger here, especially considering how they lost to Japan. I want to get ahead of myself here. But you're only two minutes into this one. Things can change very quickly, but... Just a tad sluggish. Credit Ukraine. They've come out and played strong defensively here the first couple of minutes. We still got eight minutes to go, though. The complexion of this story could change many times over the next uh, eight minutes or so. There's Batty Matty. Oh, another steal for Ukraine. Right? Another miss as well. So they're not turning that defense into offense. Here's Beck Cole. They, they can use some... Uh, some of Cole's heroics. Tough shot on the layup attempt. It's a miss. Up fake. Drive. And Koenig got caught reaching in the cookie jar. It's a foul. And Ohovic. Yeah, plenty of ball. See a little wrist there as well. So Ohovic will shoot one and splash one. It's a two-point game. Ukraine in front. There's Koenig. She was seeking and destroying against the Japanese to start things off. 
There's some contact there. She took one right in the beak. She's a tough cookie, though. Shakes it off, and she'll get to defense on Hovick. Let's it fly. Two to your eye. Six two. Ukraine. Bet Cole forces up a shot. Kunick, though, there to nearly clean up the mess. But she misses it, too. Ruliova. Oh, off the glass it goes. It's seven to two. Ukraine? Okay, KK. Keely. She can't find her uh, touch either. So the Aussies just need to stop the bleed now. Ruliova puts up a kind of a wild shot attempt. There's Kunick. Probably need to just settle in and calm down a little bit. I made mention of what uh, Coach Byron had said uh, earlier uh, to me about they do lack in, in size. So if there would be any concern for this Aussie team, that would be it. And also made mention that Ukraine is one of the more sizable uh, women's teams. As they average six feet, they average about 1.83. So they do have that notable size. And it seems to be giving Australia a little bit of a little bit of an issue. So six and a half minutes to go. We got Ukraine leading Australia seven two. So under uh, seven minutes to play, and there's Maddie Garrett finding the stroke. Two cash from outside. I'll take that. No. Takes two. She couldn't make it. But at least uh, Australia showing some signs of life here. Seven to four. Picture perfect release from Maddie Garrett. And a three point contest. Filevich turns the corner, nowhere to go. Ohovic, step back. Just a little long. Kunik keeps it alive with the tip. Now Garrick, quick step to the rim, missed it. Filevich, she pulls the trigger. And she misfires from the corner. Good pass. It's falling. Had great position. Good defense, though, from Filevich to prevent the make. Seven seconds left on the shot clock as Bet Cole gets to work. She moves right, passes left. Garrett, she's got the green light. These goals ain't loyal. Rolled out on her. Olhovic gives it up. Ruliova trying to take advantage of Bet Cole. She missed it. Olhovic, man. She's driving like an Uber employee. 8-4. Bet Cole. Oh. Right to left cross. Had her lost. Olhovic, no choice but the foul. That was in the process of the shot. But look again. And Olhovic. You got to respect her from beyond that two-point arc. So when you close out on her, Sometimes she'll she'll get that step on you. She's been putting it to use here early in this game. Approaching the midway point now, eight to five. Shuick, wild shot. Kunick with a wild pass. She's trying to get it to her partner in crime, Beck Cole. So now they try to reset defensively here. They don't have to worry about Olhovic. She's getting a, getting a break, but they do have to worry about Ruliova. No hesitation. She, gonna, she pulls it. Ball over to Yellow now, though. And here we go. Kunick fouled on the shot. Certainly sensed that her team needs her right now. They leaned on her early in game one, hoping that she takes over late here in game two. And too strong at the stripe. 
Oh, we got it back. Two. Uh-uh. And another foul on Australia. No immediate danger of being in the penalty right now. A fourth foul. Problem is, they've got nearly as many fouls as they have points. We've got four and a half minutes of a very Five points for Australia, here. four Ukraine fouls. Australia, eight compared five. to eight points for Ukraine and only two fouls. They played, it, played a little bit cleaner game. Olhovic just waiting for Rodiova to come free underneath. She was able to get the shot up, but it was tough. Defended well underneath, and Matty Garrick found the energy to make that difficult. Here's Cole. Oh, she and Keeley not on the same page. Didn't have the right position in it. And maybe we are seeing a little bit of rust here from the Aussies. Took 3x3 by Storm a couple of years back. We saw him dominating on the women's series as well. But that break away from the game. Showing some effects here. And Garrett sticks with it. Eight six. And a TV timeout. Look again at the last Garrick score. Nice finish with the left. Kisses it off the glass. And we got ourselves a ball game, ladies and gents. Or if you watch it from Australia, mates. <laughs> that got a head shake from, uh, from Julian DeBove. He's like, come on. Come on, Kyle. Some Australian accent, is it that bad, mate? No, I won't, I won't do it again. That's it. I've had enough. Oh, look at the defense. Look at the defense. Australia starting to lock in. One possession game. 349 officially on the game clock. Australia looking for their first win. They certainly don't want to start this thing off 0-2. Keeley tracks it down. Great hands, great finish. One point contest. A little bit bunched up here is Ukraine. That's not the best spacing on the court. And leads to a difficult shot attempt, but man, Shubik is able to get the thing to trickle down anyway after bouncing on the back rim. Garrick misses the crib. Filevich picks up her dribble, sets the screen for Olhovic. She lets the two fly. No man. Whoa. There's some WWE wrestling uh, move right here. What is it's 3x3 turned UFC. I don't know. I don't know what we got going here. We need to. She tap out on that? You got a 10 count? What are you? 9 7. Bet Cole. Stop and go. This, she got a good advantage here. Foul call, push on Rulliova. But that's the type of matchup that Beck Cole likes to see. The quicker of the two. We got exactly three minutes left from a very good basketball game. Nine, seven, Ukraine. And there's Beck Cole making a count at the stripe. Got to take care of the free ones. Australia within one. Tougher game than... Uh, and maybe they anticipate it. Double foul. Olhovic and uh, Froling. Both trying to box out. Good call there. I don't know if, if, if it's a push or a grab. It's a toss up. Hit them both with a foul. I'm with it. Beko moving right. Reroutes left. And it's sent back. Shubik, step back, frowling. Got a fingernail on it. And then Ohovic, a little bit of a silly foul right there. <laughs> she didn't think she should have got a whistle, but 
When you reach in, you put yourself in jeopardy getting, getting called. So the Aussies, they got a chance to tie this thing up or take the lead. Yeah, the rock in Garrick's hands. That's a good plan. 9-9. Nine, nine. Foul on the floor. Beck Coles trying to hold her ground. Couldn't do it without fouling. You hear uh, Koenig saying, one stop, one stop. Sometimes when that offense isn't flowing as well as you'd like it, you've got to, your game's got to come to you through your defensive play. Defense something, if defense is something you can always count on, you're always going to have a good chance to win games. Because that offense can fluctuate, especially when you get a little bit, of, a little bit fatigued. Got to dig deep defensively. We'll see what happens here for both teams. Nine all. Ohovic trying to break the tie. She almost broke the left side of the rim with that brick. No, I'm playing. Wasn't that bad. But uh, a bad foul. That's, that's two quick ones. And she's hearing it from her teammates saying, listen, we don't need that. Fifth foul on Ukraine, six on Australia. They got no more to give. They'll be in the penalty. We're under two minutes to play. It's crunch time like we opened the bag of potato chips. There's Kunik putting Filevich on the barbie. Oh, well, the over. I'm not sure why she attempted that tough two. She was not late in the shot clock. Got deed up. So now here, Australia is in front. Cole, nice hezzy. Through the contact. Oh, couldn't finish it. Stays with it. Great hustle. Great hustle, both teams. Now Kunik is able to draw the foul. That's now six on Ukraine. Neither team with any more fouls to give. And a timeout on the floor. 10-9 contest, Australia in front, buck 25 to play. Hell of a game. It doesn't always have to be a high scoring affair to be a, a game that you can enjoy. Sometimes it gets grimy, it gets gritty. <laughs> These are fun to watch as well. We get a brief listen in to that Ukraine huddle. Back to it, we go. Beck Cole. She's got Koenig. Great position on the interior. And she gets it done down under. But a little bit of a mental lapse there. I think Koenig started to defend in that semi-circle after the made bucket, which you know you cannot do in 3x3. You got to allow that rebounding team to clear it. That was the second warning, so that leads to a technical foul. So possession over to Ukraine as well. You'll still hear uh, Kunik saying she is the vocal leader on this team. One stop, one stop. Australia leading by one point. And they do get that stop. Now Kunik swinging through, moving strong to the left. Missed it. Too much on it. Now Beck Cole as Kunik reestablishes position. Great defense. Another jump ball, which means blue ball. They were able to tie it up. Take another look. Good hands there. Ohovic making things difficult on the Aussie OG. Position arrow to the Ukraine. So under a minute to play. It's coming down to the wire. Ohovic, oh, uh, Ruliova, excuse me, mishandled it. Now she got to try to stay in front of Garrett. Good luck with that. Couple of crossovers. Had a lost in the abyss, and now 
Couple of free throws. Take another look. Aye. Bye. Bye, Felicia. Garrick's first free throw. Bottoms. And the second one. True. Oh, great defense. Garrick with the hustle. She hit the block button and preserves the three-point lead. Look again. Look how much distance she covered to make the block. That was like a volleyball block. Met her at the net. Or oh, Hovick, nowhere to go. She was homeless. Now that Aussie defense starting to ramp up now. Two seconds left. They gotta, they'll have to force up a shot here. Oh, Hovick. I think that ball was hit back in her face on ah yeah it was on the check ball you yeah you got to give the offense a chance to start that possession and again we just saw Kunick get hit with that violation defending in the semicircle and now we get the same result here a technical foul is called and Ohovic will shoot makes one possession to Ukraine as well It's only a one possession game. Olkovic. She left something. It's got Wilson on it. It's blue and yellow. Oftentimes you need it uh, to go into the uh, to the goal. Anyway. Oh, we over. Nice move. Million dollar move. Three dollar shot. Missed the layup. That would have been critical. Oh, oh, Filevich. Looked like she was she was crossed. And Beck Cole is down for the moment. Take another look. Uh. Filevich still with the long hands, able to get a hand on the ball. Cole shaking up a little bit. Not sure, not sure exactly what's ailing her. At the free throw line for two shots. It's Cole for those There we go. Is uh, Cole's able to knock it down? Extends the lead to three, make that four. And that's going to likely put it away. Koenig with the board, clears it, but she stepped out of bounds. That was clear. Won't matter anyway. This is going to be an Australia win, a much needed, much needed Australia win to, uh, to get get a 1 1 record on the day. Final seven seconds of this one. Svilevich. Oh, she draws the foul. So hold on. We don't want to put this one on ice just yet. Just yet. Five seconds left. If Filevich can knock both of these free throws down, and Ukraine can somehow get a steal and a shot up within five seconds, it's happened before. Then we could be looking at one of the most improbable overtime. No, nope. uh -uh. not gonna happen. Missed it, and that shot missed wide left, and Australia is able to hold on. And they win it 15 to 12. They earned every bit of this one. You better believe it.